Here are the stories for the day. While walking in a small village in Jharkhand, Dr. Prasanta Tripathi and Dr. Nirmala Nair closely witnessed the state of infant and maternal mortality in rural areas. In 2002, both quit their jobs and shifted to a small railway township in Chakradharpur in Jharkhand, their native place. Poor medical services and handful of wellness centers had forced people to handle many health conditions at home and some of them would then approach the couple to discuss their health issues. They spoke to the villagers about identifying problems, their causes, effects, feasible solutions to solve them and how they could put them into practice. The exercises evolved as a group therapy model where problems were shared and potential solutions were brainstormed to healthy discussions. By 2008, about 200 villages in West Singbam and Saraikala districts of the state and Kionjar in Odisha reported a drop in infant mortality by 45%, maternal mortality by 20% and a decrease in postpartum depression by 57%. The preventive interventions model by the couple has been tried in Odisha, Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh and Bihar and has benefited a large rural population across 50,000 villages. Chandrakant Yal is a farmer from Maharashtra is growing Himachal apples in a state that is known for the largest grapes production. The achievement is significant as the region receives less rainfall and experiences humid climate. Apples are fruits that are grown in cold weather conditions. He then went to Himachal Pradesh to understand the plant variety and its weather and water requirements. In 2020, each plant yielded 5 kilos of fruit. In 2021, he sold some harvest in the village market at 150 a kilo to check the commercial viability and take customer feedback. The experiment worked in his favour and received customer appreciation. Run by 33-year-old Rajesh Kumar Suman, the Green Pachala Coaching Centre in Samastipur of Bihar provides coaching to students for various government service exams and charges saplings as a fee. The centre stands out because of its unique fee structure. Rajesh charges 18 saplings as a fee from the students. Behind taking 18 saplings as fee also has scientific logic. One person inhales as much oxygen throughout their life as 18 plants generate. So they charge 18 saplings as fees which are then planted in various places. Since 2008, more than 5,000 students have been coached for various competitive exams as this green patshala. Over 9,000 saplings collected from students have been planted since the institute's founding.